Praise Jesus. My name is C.T. Shackleford from Paducah, Kentucky. I pastor at Rocky Ford Church where Jesus is Lord. And I thank you for uh, allowing me to be able to stand here as humble as I can to bless you with the Word of God. Whenever you're watching TCT, we just know that uh, God is always working in, in this area. So uh, we thank you again for supporting and uh, giving us opportunity to share. With it being a, a day like today, with it being warm, I, it takes me to the scripture of Romans, the fifth chapter, starting at the first verse. And it says, therefore being justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus the Christ, by whom also we have access by faith into the grace wherein we stand and rejoice in hope of the glory of God. And not only so, but we glory in the tribulation, also knowing that tribulations work with patience and patience experience and experience hope and hope is make us not ashamed because the love of God is shed abroad in our hearts by the Holy Ghost, which is given unto us. When I, I read that, I always think about the uh, different things that we're going through and, and the times the, uh, and the trials and, and the hard times in our life and the storms that we go through. But like I was saying earlier, with a day like today where it's warm, I, I think about uh, deserts and, and places where things are not being able to grow. And the reason it, it don't grow and the reason it, it's hard for things to come up there is because it don't have storms. It's because things are not pouring on into them. It's because uh, it's not getting the nourishment that it needs. So we're looking forward to the trials and, and, and we look forward for the uh, tribulations and the storms in our life. Because these are the very things that make us a better person. These are the things that mature us. It, it, it make us be able to share with our youth, that our youth don't easily fall astray or don't easily get caught into things because we are able to share our experiences and, and tell our testimony. Because the only way you can have a testimony, you first gonna have to go through a test. It's amazing how many of us wants the testimony, but nobody wants to go through the test. But that test is the very thing that show us that God is continually working in our life. He's showing us how mighty He is. He's showing us how much He loves us. He gives us an opportunity to choose whether or not we want to be with the adversary if we want to be with Him. Because the more trials that you go through, the, uh, uh, the more He can show Himself mighty. Don't think it's strange when you go through things, because these are the things that's going to build you up. Don't think it's strange that your life has to be a, a tossed or turned or that the adversary is, is, is starting to come after you. Remember, a kingdom divided cannot stand. As long as you're going through something, you know you're on God's side. You know that he's gonna be uh, working in your life. Actually, I would be more concerned if nothing was happening to you. So give it an opportunity to praise God, to uh, be able to say, thank you, Lord, for showing me. Be like Job that said, no matter what's going on, I'm, I refuse to uh, denounce God in my life. I refuse to uh, turn away, for I know that He is mighty. And I'm telling you, just like Job, when it comes to the times that you can learn to pray for your enemies, when you can learn to accept God for who He is and accept the situations for what they are, watch Him put double in your life. Watch you get a, a, a portion that just pours right into you. And not only will it happen uh, uh, to the things in your life, but it will also happen to you. You'll start seeing yourself in a better light. You start seeing yourself growing. You start seeing yourself being that tree that's, that's being rooted and that's being sustained and that's being uh, nourished by the water that's flowing beside you. you. You be the one that be able to say, it's not what I've done, but it's what God has done in my life. And you could be able to tell people about His goodness, the glory, the salvation that's running through you, the atonement that he made for you to get back to your father that Adam, Adam had lost for us, the opportunities to be able to, to uh, feel the blood being poured upon you and washing you clean as snow, to be able to see things that you knew there was no way in the world you could have walked away from it if it had not been for the strength of God. These are the things that makes us stronger, our storms, our trials, our tribulation. This is why we have the hope. This is the reason for the hope that is within us, to let people know about the goodness of God, to share the good tidings, that someone might ask, what must I do to be saved? And you can find that out right here on TCT if you just tune right in and support any chance you get. I love you and God bless you and may the Lord be with you. Thank you.